Hey, what up, Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're all doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 Before You Buy video. In this video, we're going to take a look at the Nuka Cola Delivery Bundle. So, let me go ahead and grab it and review it. So, still wasting time, jump right into it. Alright, so the first item that is included within this bundle, it's called the Nuka Cola Trampoline. I hope I pronounced that correctly. If I did not do apologies, I am from Ukraine. Sometimes I mispronounce stuff. So, uh, the once you open your build uh, menu, in order to find the item, you will need to go to your MISC structures and scroll all the way down until you find it. For me, at the moment, it's just on its own. I don't need to maneuver so I can find it pretty quickly. So you'll need some rubber, spring, and steel in order to make this trampoline. It doesn't look like uh, there is any limitations on how many you can do. Uh, but once you've created one, you can actually go ahead and jump on it. Woo! <laughs> now, I did give it a test, and I've been jumping like for two minutes or so. Uh, and I did not get any buffs. You know, sometimes we have uh, items uh, that we can interact with, and if you interact with it for a minute or 30 seconds uh, you can get a buff on to agility or you know for one hour or when you sleep you get a well rested buff to get a little bit more XP well this is just the uh, animated jumping part so nothing crazy over there uh, let me also show you the trampoline from all sides while we jumping on it you can have some idea on how it looks like Alright, so I think that's more than enough. Let's take a look at the animation of how he's going to get off. Boom. <laughs> Alright, so uh, that's pretty much it. Let's move on to the next item. Alright, so the next item that we're going to be taking a look at, it's called the Nuka-Cola Delivery Truck. It's a pre-built building, basically, that you can locate in your MISC structures once you're in your building menu. I uh, don't, like... You just find it from the drop bar over here. You don't have to go to any sides to find it. Well, that is the case for me right now at the moment. So you can build uh, three of these things. So boom, I got two out of three. And you will need uh, aluminum and steel in order to build this. <laughs> I wonder why there's no concrete. Thank God for that because I'm running out of that thing. So I already got two built. Uh, let me show you to your... Uh, visually how it looks like so there's enough room over here to build a, a vending machine for instance uh, I did run around and uh, try to interact with this uh, item I was not able to locate any buttons or any electricity connectors or anything in that area so I believe so it's a building as is right which is actually a real shame because I mean I was thinking maybe there's a door that you can put in there but since we got this thing on the above right I thought it would be a really cool idea if we could have had a button or somewhere where we could open and close this door now that would be really really nice I mean having put your vending machine over here right you have your stuff selling right and uh, once you're like a max caps and you don't want people to buy stuff from you you just close this thing and that's it I mean the shop is still kinda like glowing that you're selling stuff but people can't buy it because they cannot interact with the vending machine now that would be really nice but as I said I've tried uh, to interact with this building from all areas uh, tried well it looks like in the build menu there is no electricity needed for this item so you can't really connect it plus if I click Y over here which usually triggers the wire it does not trigger so you cannot connect it to electricity but then again if we could it would be really nice that we could like drop this thing you know close it and probably like this thing glowing you know you could have done a little bit more but based on the price of the bundle that I bought this without a a discount is that it was actually a pretty decent price compared to other bundles there's a a lot worse bundles with less inter interactive uh, animations and but this one's looking really good so far I mean I'm, I'm enjoying it so that's what it is uh, and uh, I guess let's move on uh, to the next item right let's go all right, the next item that we have within this bundle, it's this Nuka-Cola thermometer. So 
in order to build it you will need to go to your wall decor section and you will be able to build it on the wall also the cool part you can do it like something like that you know switch sides boom <laughs> well I'm, I'm building within my shelter so so they kind of float but if you if I come closer to this thing oh look it kind of like switches on its own <laughs> interesting cool all right when I was messing around with it I didn't notice it actually does that <laughs> but there you go you can stick it to the wall and turn around and did not doesn't want to flip all right builders out there you can do a whole bunch of stuff with this thing I mean it is what it is that's the way it is <laughs> it's just a wall decor so it doesn't really matter all right so let's move on to the next all right, the next item we've got is the Nuka Cola uh, cask stool. Right, for me, it's located. I mean, it's located in the chair section, but for me, it's located with this uh, fancy bar chair. There, it's also Atomic Shop. If you don't own this, then you should not see this in your shop, uh, in your build menu. As long as it is, I'm not quite sure how. I don't need to double check on that but you should not see it but anyway uh, it's located in chairs so you will be able to find it there uh, here we go let's build that here so we'll probably build it here as well just to see so, so you can interact with it take a seat Choop. take a seat enjoy life life is good <laughs> oh it, it's alright I mean just a chair <laughs> but yeah if you're building like nuka cola camps so maybe it would be a, a really good addition for you I don't know uh, but let me quickly show it to you from all sides so you can see how it looks like oh another interesting thing I just want to understand so once you sit, you'll need to have that Nuka Cola sign up front so you know how to put it if you were putting it like uh, through the like to the table. So you'll need to have this little metal thing going up. But let's see if we sit from the other side. Will he sit the way and s still facing the same way, or this thing I forgot to double check on? Yeah, it looks like so. Yeah. All right, so it looks like let's just pretend that uh, trampoline is a chair. I mean, a table. We'll need to build it like this, so we sit towards table. So that metal thing should go up, and now if we sit, we should be facing directly to the trampoline. There you go. All right, I think this is a pretty enough demonstration for this chair, and let's move on to the next item. Alright, so the next item that we're going to take a look within this uh, bundle is going to be the vending machines. So you will need to navigate to your vendors tab in your build menu and uh, find the, in our case, that would be Sweetie Pete vending machine, Nuka Quantum. And the funny part, I did not know you can build vending machines in shelter. <laughs> so I was planning to move out to the open world and build it there, but it turns out you can actually also build these things here. I did not know that, to be honest. So it's a pleasant uh, discovery for me. So also, well, as always, you can build uh, up to four vending machines, uh, right? Uh, these vending machines also you can stack them so you can see if you build one then you can stack another one and then you can stack another one that's going to be a, uh, a limit right so bam you can't build anymore but if you have this robot right that's just from another bundle if I'm not, not mistaken you can also stack and maybe there are other robot versions that you can stack no it's totally different but as you can see uh, the difference between these two is just it's the skin so basically but it's a cool thing that they stack so you can create a line of you know you get the picture right but this guy was not included within this bundle just this vending machine just to make it perfectly clear so it does require three power in order to operate it does make uh, animations ton of time throwing candy and then also uh, making like pouring some drinks 
So yeah, well, it is what it is. Uh, let's move on to the next item. All right, and the next uh, item that we have, and the final item that we have for this specific bundle, which was a real big pain to find, uh, it's the Nuka Cola Wagon Planter, right? For me, it's located at the floor decor behind this plant, which makes no sense. Why is it under that? So this is what we have then we're gonna go to my camp and see if we can actually plant something in on this thing I cannot do that here because we cannot plant anything in uh, shelters so yeah I mean I was looking all over I thought it was gonna be here because you know we have the plant wagons right uh, so I thought that they are gonna be here like boom boom you see but what the hell is it doing there? It took me a while to find. So floor decor. This is also an atomic shop item. So you might just see it like this. So I'm not sure. So if you want to build this thing, you will need to go to uh, your floor decor. Now, let's go ahead and take a look if, like visually, quickly take a look. I mean, it's not that super wow, wow, wow item in my book. Uh, but yeah, it is what it is. There we go. I think this is more than enough to understand. And I'm gonna go grab a plant that is not big because I don't think I'll be able to fit in what I'm growing at my camp <laughs> and see who can grow something on that thing. All right, so you can't plant anything on this. So it's just a planter basically like it's supposed to be a plant but it's a dead plant <laughs> so it's like just just this tree like a you know a plant decoration where's the floor thingy damn it uh, where you at man oh there you go like it's just this tree it's just a decoration <laughs> Alright, so this is where I'm going to be calling in the end for this video, so I hope you enjoyed it and found it useful, and if you did, you know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below, please make sure not to use profanity as those comments uh, get triggered by YouTube, nobody see them, nobody can read them, nobody can respond to them. So do have that in mind. And if you're new, you subscribe, welcome to Z Client. I'm Gamer Z, Soul from Ukraine, so hi from Ukraine. Once again, thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. And by the way, uh, as of recording this video, which is the 8th of December 2022, uh, there's still a war going on in Ukraine, so if you're feeling to do any sort of charity, I will list two links so that will lead you to two different funds created by the NBU, which is the National Bank of Ukraine. And one fund is for military, the other one is for humanitarian. So if you're open to doing any charity, feel free to use those links. And thank you for all the love and support. So you all have a good one. Bye. From the